Atlas, Yo, what's going on, YouTube? Bring you a little OWC match. I'm gonna try to get fights in with new people, man, but kind of hard. So I'm like, fuck it, I'm gonna record this one. So let's see what happens, man. He's he's coming in. Uh, what was he? Six feet. 76 inch reach. I'm coming in at 5'10 with 73 inch reach. So, uh, of course, you got the height and reach advantage, as always. But uh, let's see what happens, man. Let's see what he's talking about. by KO that's on his belt. I don't play too much OWC. I always start over and make another player and shit. Oh shit, he coming out of Houston too. Remember guys, Obey my commands at all times. Let's have a good, clean fight. Touch him up. Let's see what's up. Opening round scheduled for Taz. Teddy, what should we look for early? We've heard so much about his jab. Is it as simple as that? It is. For him, it is. I mean, not just from the offensive end, the defensive yeah, end, and also those two counters fighter. good as well. You know, it gets the distance right there. that he needs to complete everything else. Martinez's power is dynamic, truly dynamic. The kind of stuff that could end this fight early on. Yeah, it is, but there's a danger to that, too. If he doesn't land early to... on, if he doesn't have his way early on, maybe he gets discovered. Big trade shots. He comes back with a right hand. Combo, combo. Hey, Able to dismiss on, it. It's not what he was looking for. That's a miss right there by Martinez. <laughs> I'm gonna try to fucking work his body, make him slow down. And coming and upon the halfway mark of this three minute round. <laughs> Blocks that belt line well. Martinez is able to land his nice clean left hand. the two punch combo by the assassin he scored well after being hit himself there's the combo downstairs to go in this round. Blocks the headshot. Okay. Okay. Relax now. Okay, okay, How are you feeling dude. today? Just stay alert in there, okay? Just stay alert. I need you to, I need you to come forward with your power hand. Alright? Cut him off. Cut him off. Come forward. Here we go. Round two is underway. Tucks those elbows in, blocks the body shot. He is not in good shape. He can, oh, that's got to hurt. Go. He goes to that face to that nonstop attack. It's like he's thrown into a blender of punches. Right on the side of the neck. Send that shock through his whole body when he feel that hit. Don't come back and drop me right here. This shit always happens. Down he goes, but he's gonna continue on. They got plenty of time in the round. Nice block by Hound Dog. Right back to it upstairs. 
Not able to land a headshot. Oh, you got this one. to go here in this round. What the hook? Scores well to the belt line again. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Good way to protect the midsection. Wow, he backs up the combination, laying it all four of them. that gut. Move your head. Come on, baby. Move your head. Just move. Good defense upstairs to stay away from that offensive assault. Hunches and bunches. Combination up top. Miss the target with that hook. He started to move because he started filling them holes. They got 94 coming in, so and I was throwing a shitload of power in that one. Take a deep breath. Take a deep breath. This is your night. Keep closing the gap. When you get close to him, fans come. in a tough spot here. 60 seconds. That's all you get to gather yourself after being knocked down. Good. Good block there by the assassin. He's targeting downstairs time and time again. A well-placed overhand right. Nice. And now he's targeting upstairs. That is Boxing 101. A nice, crisp combination by Hound Dog. Good step back counter punch there. Come on, kid. Focus now. I need you to focus. Gets rid of that. Coming to the halfway point of this third round. Still good on stamina, so yeah, I know he doesn't like it. Number four, as we look at Teddy's scorecard, that's why I'm coming at him. Knockdown is a big difference maker here, and that's the thing, he has the power to separate himself a little bit in this fight. His opponent doesn't have that. Nice, sharp, fundamentally sound hook right there, and it's serving well. by Martinez. He just missed that shot up top. Oh, nice. He's finding out right now. He's coming with two. Nice ass hook. He's not getting the results he needs in these middle rounds. What is he? Well, when 
the guy's not coming in and walking in, you can't count as much. I mean, he's not, he's not giving you the kind of turn that you need. Now you have to find a way to create your offense, to lead a little bit. That starts with the jam, getting off first. Turns over that hook, and he does damage upstairs. Oh, good exchange there. Hound Dog's got to cut. It looks like it's below the eye on the sheet, but it's something that needs to be monitored. Ah, let's go. Martinez has got to deal with a cut sheet. with that headshot. You see, he sits and waits and then strikes with that counter punch by Hound Dog. Hound Dog is landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. Boxing, we 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 throwing down, I'm that pushing that shit. You gotta make a fight see, right I wasted a lot of my stamina, but it's all good. I'm trying to get him tired. Good action here tonight. Both guys bringing their best, and both guys meeting each other, stride for stride, punch for punch. Tough place to score here as we're back underway. How about that four punch combination? Well, his opponent is opening up and coming forward. Let me see, he think so I'm going to come and do the same shit this time. Yeah, I think some counter-punching opportunities. Opportunities yeah, not on the front end, time to box but on Martin the back now. end. Oh, a nice two-punch combo by Martinez. Good job, buddy. Keep moving, keep moving. Swinging and missing like he's at bat right there. That punch was nowhere near his opponent. Combo, combo. Hook, hook. Halfway yeah, into round number five here. Counters and shit. Hound Dog's doing well here with that two punch combination. Solid uppercut. Uppercut! Uppercut! Boom! Well, something's got to stick. He sends the combination to the body. Good looking right hand after he got hit. He tried to nab him up top, but was unable to connect. Turns the favor with a right hand of his own. Hound Dog's defense did a good job there, able to avoid that punch. He takes a shot and then commits to give him one right back. That is exactly what the corner wanted to see. A good combination punch by the assassin. And we come to the end of the round. That was fucking the amazing, dude. The corner has to keep him calm. That's the kind of cut that can send a fighter into fits. Yeah, the corner man into using crazy on, let's go. instead of adrenaline. I mean, that is a scary cut, as you just said. You gotta land a big punch now, champ. No doubt about it. You're losing this fight. You need to throw and land a big shot in... The start of the sixth round. Martinez has done everything that's been asked of him right now. That's absolutely everything in the first half of this fight. Can he keep it up? Keep working the body. The assassin slugging style is really paying off here, Teddy. We're in the middle rounds of these fights. And it's clear to me who's controlling us. Yeah, well, the reason it's clear to you is he's got the fight in the quarters, in the dimensions he wants it, in nice and tight. Hound Dog's combination punching is just perfect there. Three punches landing. What a nice combo by the assassin. 
Holy crap. By a left hand. Oh, what kind of punching is this? I mean, he's got nothing on these shots. He's so hurt. You know, Martinez is <laughs> 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 Okay, that's good, that's good, that's good. We thought it was a bad thing. That's good for me, bad for him. It turned out to be a bad thing for his opponent. Because he's not going here. That's what I like to see, man. I want to see a nice, bloody fight. We need to, we need to start doing bare knuckle fights, man. I try to record, but you know, some people don't have bare knuckles, so it's kind of hard to find a bare knuckle fight. Creative fighters. Whoever got bare knuckles, man, hit me up. Let's, let's do some fights, man, for YouTube. Say he was winning. Knockdowns have been the difference. Yeah, that's why he's ahead. At least on my scorecard, I don't, of course, know what the officials have. But you would think it would be the same thing. But also, this is a great exhibition and example of a guy that doesn't have the physical talent. His opponent can't keep up with him with power. 
But as far as guts, as far as consistency, being dependable, he has all those attributes. It's keeping him in the fight. The Assassin's defense is playing a prominent role in this fight, Teddy. Yes, it is, and specifically what it is is he has good fundamentals. He keeps those hands up real good, you know, to attach they're up around his chin, his elbows in. You know, he has a real shell there that's not easy to penetrate. What an excellent two-punch combo by Hound Dog. The halfway point of round number eight. It looks like he's getting tired. Some people say they, they hit the they hit the low blow button on accident. I ain't, I ain't never hit the low blow button on accident. Man, you must have got some big ass fingers or some big ass hands or something. You still got me with that one. Comes to an end. Martinez's one man is going to earn his pay for sure. That is a bad catch. And I wondered what he's going to go around nine. Hey man, you know, you can only use certain things. Abertine, adrenaline, and trumpet. I'm wondering if he's using illegal things right now because that's the kind of cut that tempts you to use crazy glue. The assassin's in a good rhythm defensively here. Teddy, what is that, a credit to his ability to anticipate? You know, also, it's the teaching. Let's give the trainers credit. Of course, let's give his background of the amateurs credit, but he learned hey, how to get away from punches. Go. This is technique that was taught to him. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Well-targeted two-punch combo by Hound Dog. Shake it off! As basic as can be, but it works. A jab followed by the straight. Didn't get it done going to the body there.
Martinez is going to have to pull himself together here. Now, he beat the count, but still a lot of work to do. Yeah, a lot of work because he doesn't have the benefit of his legs. Can't move around there wobbly right now. So what he's going to do is grab on a little bit and walk. Walk to the rope. Still some time. Make the referee come in between you and break you. That was a fine block by Hound Dog. That is a big right hand after eating one himself. You do what you do. We have a by the assassin. The assassin's punch is far off the target. Martinez throwing wide punches. If I'm standing opposite of that, I jump on you. Yeah, well, if you're the fighter, that's where you have to be kind of like into a Kodak moment. Where you take a picture and you say, okay, remember that, and the next time, bang. He returned the fire. Wow! Get your ass up, baby. Let's go. Get up. Stay down. No, I mean, stay down, motherfucker. Stay down. Bam. Bam. The round. Up. So there's the final bell in a fight nobody thought they'd hear the final bell in. Uh, it looked like Rocket That's some shit, man. Who won? Guess what? They started boxing. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo! What up, my nigga? Hard push, hard fought fight. And I pulled the win out. Martinez's work tonight was well rewarded. A unanimous decision win. Teddy, you saw it all along. It was easy, and he saw it all along. That's the thing. He saw the punches coming all night long. He was good to I wasn't even, win, like, paying attention to winning around. I was, like, so focused in, in the fight. Like, I just felt, I, like, I told myself I was losing. So I had to put pressure. Winner by KO, that's his name. He's a spamming ass nigga, anyways. <laughs> well, there it is, man. I pulled it out. Got the W. It was a good fight, though. I mean, he's a sidestep motherfucking straight fucking punk ass bitch, but. I like these fights because, you know, it's testy. When we fight them, them damn spammers that were real good at what they do, you gotta change your whole game plan on how you fight to try to get on the inside to work them. But shit, it was a good fight. Winner by KO, bitch ass nigga. But that's what's up, man. Check it out. Let me know what's up. Appreciate it. Thanks for watching. And that's Houston.